Now we're going to turn to the medical debate stirred up by NFL superstar Peyton Manning. The Indianapolis Colts quarterback has been sidelined this season by a neck injury. Surgery after surgery has failed, so Manning recently flew to Europe for stem cell therapy that's not approved in the U.S. As ABC's John Berman reports, that has some doctors here crying foul. All-pro quarterback Peyton Manning has thrown thousands of perfect passes in NFL games. But it's his latest medical Hail Mary that's causing controversy. Manning, out for months with a bulging disc in his neck, reportedly traveled all the way to Europe for experimental, and some say dangerous, adult stem cell therapy. When you leave a well-regulated environment, all bets are off. In treatment that is not approved by the FDA, stem cells are harvested from a healthy part of your body, then injected into the problem area. The hope is they can repair damaged cells. But the problem, some doctors say, is there is simply not enough proof it works for this type of injury. Experimenting on humans or promising things to humans that can't really be delivered, that's not ethical. Manning is one of the game's megastars, clearly desperate to get back on the field. Before the season, he said, to say I'm disappointed in not being able to play is an understatement. I am doing everything I can to get my health back. The worry is... If hundreds or thousands of people then go out and say, oh, well, it was good enough for Mr. Manning, what about me? It doesn't appear that Manning's stem cell treatment was successful. He just had his third surgery in 19 months and could be lost for the season. For Good Morning America, John Berman, ABC News.